good morning students today we will talk about past participles past participle are the third form of our verb we use past participle to form the perfect tense when we are writing sentences belonging our tenses in perfect tense we are using our past participles all right now what is it i it may be used as a verb and as an adjective our past participle can be used as a verb and it can be used as our adjective too all right let's see some examples sentence number a i have chosen the picture i want here our verb is chosen and it belong to our past participle chosen is the third form of our verb choose all right sentence number b the chosen picture was a portrait here also the word chosen belongs to our past participle but students the first sentence where we have got chosen it works like a verb all right now i have chosen the picture i want i have chosen and selected i have done some work that's why the word chosen indicates that it is used here in this sentence as a verb all right come to sentence number b the chosen picture was a portrait which type of picture the chosen picture the picture is described by the word chosen or the word chosen tell something about picture and picture is our noun the word which tells about noun that is adjective is it right so here in sentence number b the word chosen works like an adjective okay this is only the difference all right now it is not the thing that in all verb you will get the same ending when you form that particular verb as our past participle it is not the thing that in every verb you will get the same ending means like is here you will get like like third one is like it is it is not necessary that in all the verbs you get the same ending it is not like that some changes are there that's why it is written here some past participles ends with another form it is the third form of the verb but the same alphabets or same letters you will not get at the end let us see how come to number a ask ask is our main verb means we one in we to we get asked and again we three that is our past participle asked all right number b begin begin began and then began so sorry 
with here ending with ed here again ending with un it is same no it is completely different is it right let us solve another one number c cut in our cut we are getting cut 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 no changes all right number d break break is a break broke third one broken now number e no new third one is no Now number F. Right, wrote, written. Something different is there, isn't it? Now next one. Number G. Leave, left. Third one is left. Number H. Go. Wait. Go on. The ending is same in all. No. That's why the point is given here. Some past participles ends with another letters, or it has its another form for their endings. Means our past participles. in with some different letters also the same ending will not get in all the forms all right so students for our past participle we got some words which are used as our verb and for our adjective also means past participle is working as a verb and working as an adjective also all right so students keep on learning take care thank you